Yes, Hutch! Yes! You got it. There, and then just all the way into here, and it doesn't look like anything, but it's horrible. Oh my god! What are you? Expert on making small things look real big. Alright, so welcome back to the Contour Collective channel. Uh, you might be like me and spend most of your weekends out on your bike and riding with my mates and trying to keep up with them. So in this video, I've grabbed a few friends. Uh, we're heading out into the woods and I want to look at a few different ways that you can get the most out of your rides with friends and get faster. So I'm heading out with uh, Fergus Ryan, uh, Miles James and Archie Box. They're all top level riders in the UK and yeah, good friends of mine. Um, I, when I was younger, I used to ride with some really quick riders when I was growing up and that really helped uh, my riding. So uh, I grew up with Ben Cathro and uh, Rory Cunningham, Stu Thompson and yeah, always just followed them around. I was out riding with them and that made a huge difference to my riding. I'm a few years older now, but I'm going to apply some of those principles and yeah, see how we got on today and what improvements we can make. We're going to jump into some of the trails in Forsadeen and yeah keep watching for some top tips on how to get faster by riding with faster riders okay so tip one's a really easy one and it really just involves trying to get into new locations and ride mates trails so this track here fergus Ryan built during uh, the last year and knows it really well and has taken on a few few of these gaps in the past so it's really good to just push your riding oh with the sort of knowledge of oh someone else's local trails. Oh yes Hutch! <laughs> yes! That That's the money we pay for. The money shot. <laughs> we'll try this double gap for the third time. We only hit turns in the box. Only turns, can't do anything else, just turns. But turns are good. Dana's ready! So we followed Archie in last time, we followed Fergie who created these, knows them well. Nice, I just like boosted to the moon and went in slow and then just <laughs> went pop! It's so much nicer isn't it? I was like committed to the gap but not to the turn. Try it though, good to try it. Well, you got to try these things, haven't you? So tip two is about riding terrain in different ways. Thinking about pumping instead of maybe jumping something. So I'm just gonna roll through these bumps now. So thinking about what you're doing in the vertical plane is something that a lot of riders forget to consider. So it's really important to help ride the trail well. All right, so we've got another little line option. We've got a high line up here or over this rock into the into this bomb hole. So yeah, good to play around on this. Try a few options. Archie, uh, Archie called the gap from from back there into the bomb hole. So we'll see if he does that. So this is tip number three. Just get out there and challenge yourself. Try and find stupid features and just send it. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh my god! I know, mate. Yeah. Oh, Craig, what I'll do is I'll follow you in, but not do it and go the other way. Yeah. Right, so Frank's gonna go for the gap on the right, but I'll try the left. That's where the speed's getting to the exit. I mean, we'll call it a landing, technically. Oh. Your front wheel case it? Yeah, I, no. I, my front wheel stop. Now we're gonna look at a few routy lines with different options left and right. And yeah, just see how uh, speed carries through the, the trail and uh, just sort of feed off each other, try a few things and yeah, sort of help each other out. Be a good little section to do it on. Oh, it's way too dark. Got to. Oh, look at him! Yeah. Way better. That's the line. Where are we going this time? We're gonna another line. Gonna come out wide um, and compressing these roots here. So tip number four is just about trying different lines, seeing how your mates get through different sections. It can be quite surprising how people approach sections differently and just keep an eye on body position, breaking points and of course where you're going on the trail, how you're setting up for corners. Yes! Smooth, smooth. So tip number five and the final one of this video is just looking at how your mates are setting up your bike, thinking about suspension, tire pressures, and even what mudguard you're running. Over the sort of 20 years of riding I've, I've been doing, it's really useful just to, just to see what other riders are doing and uh, yeah, I couldn't overstate the benefits of riding with faster riders and especially in locations that uh, people are local, if you're not from there, you can go and benefit from riding new places and just, um, just seeing how they approach their local trails, they'll have lines that you might not spot straight away and you can really take advantage of that and um, so yeah just get out there with faster riders hang on to the back of them watch what they're doing where they're going how they're setting their bike up and that's going to be a really good way of just getting yourself ready for races or just being able to keep up with your mates in the woods so i think today i've definitely managed to learn a few things off the others how to huck and uh take on some new gaps and yeah it's been a real good day out so we'll uh, see you at some races soon hopefully and yeah make sure you hit subscribe and keep an eye on some of the other videos we've got rolling out this year catch you later hello Archibald hello enjoying the time out in the woods today yeah how's it being the fastest rider here showing us how to do it all right, <laughs> uh, what's it like Arch being the fastest rider here showing us how to do it oh, I said Ferg won't like that oh. this is these are his turns, they are my turns. look at these turns <laughs>